What about a man? A hormonal imbalance in a man can be revealed in a few ways. One is low sperm count, uh, PD, called penile dysfunction, inability to hold an erection. Another symptom of a man having a hormonal imbalance would be prostate problems. We didn't even know what the word prostate meant 20 years ago. It's almost a household name today. Another symptom, uh, too much of a female hormone can cause a man to be effeminate and too much of the male hormone in a female can cause a woman to be masculine. So see, these are some of the symptoms of a hormonal imbalance in men and women. What I want to do now is I want to show you how the monthly cycle should run in a woman. And then I want to show you what throws the monthly cycle out. And then I want to end this lecture by showing you how you can bring that cycle back into balance. Notice that our sex hormones are made from cholesterol. Very important lipid in the human body is cholesterol. You can have too high cholesterol levels and you can have too low cholesterol levels. Anything under 3 is too low. In fact, ideally, a person should not go under 3.5. From cholesterol, the body makes pregnenolone. And from pregnenolone, the body makes progesterone. Progesterone is a key hormone because from progesterone estrogen is made, from progesterone testosterone is made, and from progesterone our adrenal hormones are made. I'm going to explain the monthly cycle like a dance because it is like a dance.